Thank you so much for watching Tomo Fujita Music. <clears throat> Sorry about my voice. It's always um, seasonal allergy around, you know, um, beginning of April, you know, end of uh, March. I'm sort of suffering about uh, over two weeks almost, you know, <clears throat> this little bit congestion. And uh, don't worry, I'm not, you know, I don't have a COVID, so don't worry. <laughs> Stay closer to the camera. Today I'm gonna sh um, show you how to practice bending. As you know, I use a lot of bending, and thank you so much for your uh, kind of words on my bending. The reason I'm good at it, something, just because I know how to practice, how to prepare, and constantly, I work really hard. I make effort, make make a lot of effort, and make you know um, progress. Uh, so the first, you know, few things. Okay, so when you practice bending, you cannot play like this. You can't play solo like a phrase because that's phrase. That's not the technique. Do you know? So if you use like you know. If you do that, that's performance. So you have to separate performance and practice. Practice is technique to achieve you know certain level so that performance will get better. But if you play keep playing performance, not really effective unless you do it every day, you know, all the time, you know. So yeah. So the first one is a C major scale here. Okay, and then you have to use brighter sound, you know, nice tube amp, I'm using two rock, why not? Okay, first one, third string, fifth fret, using a third finger, you bend up like that, slowly. Now, important, my, my left uh, thumb, <coughs> thumb is really relaxed. I don't go like this kind of blues rock way. That's like a lot of power. I'm using really less power. So like a strap is really important. Strap is really holding my guitar and my elbow is holding my guitar. And then now here. But I give you about a about an example. Now you're adding a vibrato. Vibrato is again a different thing. First you have to do um, bending. See two amp really pushes it. Now E to F. Then real note. Just in case, third finger, second finger, first finger. So great results come from if you are knowing your loved one who you live with or your roommate because you do the same thing over and over insanely. So now G to A. <coughs> Sorry. I mean, if I if I show you how I practice, you're gonna probably die. 
<laughs> you can listen to me because I do same thing over and over. Annoying. Now last one, B to C. So in, very important part is the thumb position. You have to really watch my thumb position. And then my first finger, see? I'm muting second string. And then I'm using palm on my hand right here, bottom strings. So idea is you work on a technique but you are getting sounds like a performance sound but you only do one at a time so I only do bending so like limitation is really important limitation right now C major scale no vibrato only bending Okay, so one more time. So each one. Five, ten times, each one more, <laughs> I do more. But. And check the real notes. Never, never ever, you know, perfect, you know, so you have to keep practicing. If you have any question, write it here, you know. <coughs> and then you the backwards. So this is hard because you have to imagine. Ta -da, la -da. So, of course, other things you have to do, ear training, singing, recognize pitch, really, you know... So two things really, you know, so C major scale, first one, second one, E major scale. Okay, so use like a second string. Like that. Then this pattern, I go Do, Re, Mi. palm muting and release. Little noise, so you have work. Re, mi, fa. See, my sound gets louder because I have really loud volume so that I don't use uh, full picking, it just use that's about 40% of my picking. I don't use that. Okay. 
No, here. Mi fa sol right here. So like this one. See, when you um, bring down sometimes, you get noise from because you're pushing third string. When you bring down, you know, you hear. So I use my first finger to mute other strings like that, you know. Like, so sometimes, like this, I change. <laughs> Actually, I learned this, this technique uh, cover of guitar magazine, I think Joe Walsh or somebody from Eagles bending and they using this finger like that. That's what I knew. Wow, that's how you um, mute. So that's picture. <laughs> Once again, from E. Second note. Third note. Fourth note. Fifth. Six, sorry. Seven. So that's my basics uh, bending major scale. So that I don't really practice pentatonic scale for bending because pentatonic, anything you play. So it sounds pretty good, you know, so it's a problem. It's, if it sounds good, then you can really find out what's wrong. So for the bending, I don't really practice blues. So once again, I play C major scale. E major scale.
Something like that. If you play melody, that's a good way to do. But also, I, I, I make this etudes、uh, for my students. Very difficult. Thank you so much for watching Tomofushita Music. If you like this video, please share with your friends. That's very nice. And make sure turning on notification button so you won't miss my、uh, post from my YouTube channel, Tomofushita Music. And if you want to learn more guitar, more detail, of course, I have a guitar wisdom site that so many. Uh, video of a beginner series, theory, theory two, jazz standards, sight reading. I think really good, good deal to learn so much from me in more detail. All right. So, see you soon. Thanks so much.